Am I the asshole? For referring to my son's wedding reception as a barbecue? My son and his partner, both of whom are in their early forties, were married on Friday. They decided to have a very simple courthouse wedding with only a select few close family members in attendance followed by a backyard barbecue reception at their home with more friends and extended family invited. Leading up to their event I had misplaced the date a couple times as my phone calendar has been acting up and not syncing with my computer which was the device I had used to input their wedding. Due to this I had a few times accidentally went to make other plans for this weekend before being corrected. Erroneously I responded I had forgotten about their little barbecue get together and I would change my other plans. Again, my phone calendar has not been populating from my computer. Additionally, unlike with my daughter's wedding where I was very involved, my son and his partner wanted everything to be understated and simple and so I had no involvement in planning. They have been partners close to 20 years at this point and I consider them basically married for all intents and purposes. I am finding, however, now that the event is over, my daughter has told me she didn't like the way I spoke about the wedding or reception. In particular she did not like that I referred to their party as a barbecue apparently. I find that since their father and I divorced that all the fault lies with me in my children's eyes. I wasn't aware of any offense, but my son will never tell me when he is upset and prefers to more or less ignore me half of the time. I'm still not sure what social faux pas I've made with the younger crowd this time, perhaps. Nothing and my family in particular is sensitive. Of course, I will apologize to my son if he took any offense. Their little barbecue get together. Yeah, you're the asshole. You're the asshole. Little barbecue get together. Is so belittling of what the event actually was. Just because they've been together for a long time and the ceremony wasn't that big, doesn't mean it wasn't a big deal. You're the asshole. Little barbecue get together. That comment alone tells me exactly what kind of person you are and by the sounds of it you were lucky to even be invited, especially since you insult them by pretending to have phone issues and claiming you double booked yourself. Not everyone needs a massive wedding and just because you probably micromanaged your daughter into an over-the-top wedding doesn't mean that your son wanted the same. You're the asshole just for continually forgetting the date in the first place. Calling it a barbecue is icing on an R cake. So the couple themselves never called it a little barbecue. OP coined the term. I wouldn't blame this on your divorce, or that your family is sensitive you should apologize sincerely and use it as a way to open up communication between yourself and your children. Yep you're the asshole here. You're the asshole. You referred to your son's wedding as their little barbecue which is pretty dismissive, and implied you had forgotten about it. What's the matter mad because you didn't get to run the show? You referred to your son's wedding as a little barbecue get together. You're the asshole. You're the asshole stop blaming technology for what should be an important date for your calendar. If you are having IT issues, then put it in manually. Little barbecue get together was also out of line, it was their reception, how they wanted it for their day. Sounds like you were salty because you had not been involved well, get this, it's not about you. You definitely need to apologize, then take some time to reflect on your behavior and how it affects others. You're the asshole, their little barbecue get together you clearly think it's a dumb idea and are purposely downplaying their wedding reception because you were not involved. Obviously you wanted to plan it and because you didn't you are being petty and passive aggressive. No wonder they wanted it simple and understated because I bet you would completely take it over and make it about you. My mother-in-law does this same shit and I swear I heard her voice while reading this. You're the asshole. You shouldn't need a calendar to remember your son's wedding. And it was insensitive to call it a little barbecue. You did your best to show your son that his big event isn't a big event for you. Stop, you know exactly what you are doing. It's passive aggressive, and it's pathetic. How old are you? You're the asshole. You're the asshole. It may be just their little barbecue get together your words to you, 
but it's their wedding, and you're trivializing it. You weren't interested in being there, and it shows. It's clear that you see nothing wrong with your attitude, even though you were told that you caused offense. The fact that you will only apologize to your son if he took any offense shows that you don't believe you did anything wrong, and that you're not actually sorry. You're the asshole. This whole thing smacks of resentment. Your son didn't have you help plan the event like your other child did so you've decided to downplay the whole thing. To include condescending remarks like your little barbecue. I'm also getting a lot of they hate me ever since the divorce. Toxic AF. You're the asshole. You're calling your son's wedding a little barbecue get together plus you literally forgetting it multiple times tells me you honestly don't care for it. Which makes you an asshole. Do better. My wedding was at a park, with subway party subs and a grocery store wedding cake. I'd be pissed at anyone who referred to it as a picnic just because it didn't fit their standards of a wedding. You very obviously are dismissing their wedding reception by calling it a little barbecue get together. And this whole post come off as criticizing everyone else while refusing to admit your mistake. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. It's not very hard to manually input a date into your phone calendar. You just sound pissy that they didn't want you involved in the planning of it unlike with your daughter's wedding. I understand you considered them married after 20 years, but if they went through the trouble of organizing a ceremony it's because they care. A wedding is an important event no matter how they choose to celebrate it, and you haven't had the proper consideration towards it. You're the asshole. You're the asshole, I would have let you crack on with your other plans and had my little barbecue without you. This is the most passive aggressive post I've ever read. Mom, is that you? You're the asshole. You're the asshole, not everyone wants to spend a lot of money and have some huge event to celebrate their love. They're still just as married as any other couple, you know except you and their dad of course. You're the asshole, a wedding a barbecue and equating it to that makes this huge moment in their life seem like nothing. Also perhaps nothing and my family in particular is sensitive, maybe you just don't realize how your actions are affecting them and need to take a look at yourself. You're the asshole. Your entire post is dripping with condescension. I'd be pissed too if you were my mother. You sound exhausting. You're the asshole. You couldn't remember one very important date without your calendar. Also, even now after you knew how it upset your son you're still referring to it as a barbecue. You're the asshole twice because instead of accepting that you did something wrong and apologizing you're trying to write it off as my family is just sensitive. You're the asshole. Dismissive and rude are the words that come to mind. And not even bothering to remember the, you suck. You're the asshole for everything mentioned in the comments already, and also for saying you would apologize to your son if he took any offense. He didn't take offense, you clobbered him with it.